Hey guys, we have a really interesting tour for you today. We're outside the filter house. This is a converted Anglian water pumping station. It's exclusively listed by Fine & Country in Bury St. Edmunds and is priced at 1.25 million. Hey guys, so welcome into the entrance of the property. Such a grand entrance here and through the imposing doors you literally come in and you can see all the way throughout the ground floor. Yeah. You've got exposed brick which is really nice, it reminds me kind of an industrial kind of feel. And to the right of me we've got a study room and to the left of us is a little cloak room so put your shoes away out of the hallway. And come on through, check out this staircase in the middle. As Summer says, it's got a very New York loft style kind of feel about the place. Literally, the height of these ceilings throughout here are one of my favourite parts. So now let's head into um, the cinema room. So in this property, mainly downstairs is the bedrooms, which is obviously different to the average kind of house where the bedrooms are upstairs and the kitchen is downstairs, it's the opposite. So this is the cinema room or a bedroom if you wanted to have an extra one. Yeah, fantastic space, um, ideal cinema rooms, you've got kind of ambient lighting yeah. throughout here which kind of really helps with that vibe. Um, just so cool, so if you check out the master yeah. bedroom. Yeah, let's head over to the master bedroom now. Literally, as you're coming through yeah. here, you can see the size of the master bedroom stretching all the way through out to the outside. And as someone said, they chose to have the bedrooms on the ground floor and the living accommodation upstairs just to make the most of these fantastic views looking over the river. Yeah, so we've got double doors coming in. We've got a dressing area um, to the left of us and an ensuite to the right. And also Ooh. another little dressing area yeah. here. You've got so. two dressing rooms, kind of like his and hers separate dressing rooms and the ensuite. And it comes on through. A fantastic size bedroom um, with so much sunlight just beaming in. Um, yeah. Really, really nice. So wake up in the morning, come outside, have a cup of tea. Yeah, and so I do. So the original house, which was the filter house, which is, was originally built in early 1950s and, and has since been redeveloped to this masterpiece. Yeah, so after 50 years of it working as a filter house um, for Anglian Water, it was actually decommissioned. And then 10 years later, the developers, Tibetans, took over and created this beautiful house. Yeah. So yeah, quite an interesting backstory for a, a new build kind of conversion property. Yeah, and really the location here is absolutely fantastic. You're overlooking the river behind here, and then every other way you've looked, you've just got open fields and there's a nature reserve behind, which is actually up for sale by separate negotiations. So if you want to find out a little bit more about that, you can speak to the agent. So guys, if you're enjoying the video so far, make sure to check out our channel and watch our series of other luxury listings because we're touring properties all over the UK. So now we're gonna go back into the house, head through another bedroom and work our way upstairs. Let's go. So yeah, this is the next bedroom and it's also got a suite, which is really nice. Yeah, one of the best things about all the bedrooms being downstairs and also in such a large converted building for me is that all the bedrooms are all really yeah, good sizes. They're so There's big. not really any compromised rooms. They're all this grand space. All the other suites are good sizes as well with big showers in. And I think yeah. that's a really nice feature. And I just love the patio doors out to the garden. Like yeah, from all three rooms yeah. down there as well. Right, now let's head back through to the um, hallway. So the ground floor accommodation is accessed from a kind of L shape. And behind us here, you've got another really nice bedroom with French doors outside. And um, it's own en suite in there as well. Yeah, and here we've got the family bathroom. So, you know, something to have in the house if you don't want to use your en suites, but. Yeah. Now I think it's time to check out the upstairs living accommodation and those views from upstairs. Yeah. So guys, look at these stairs. I think this is one of my favourite parts of the property because I just love the industrial kind of style. I feel like you don't see that often enough in properties in the yeah. UK. It's the space, isn't yeah. it? It's just everything is just oversized in the property. I really like yeah. that. Yeah. Right, let's head upstairs. Okay guys, so now we are in the kitchen and open plan living area on the second floor. And I love this island they've got here. It's like a white workshop with a marble finish, which I really love. 
And we've got great appliances throughout, loads of NEF appliances fitted over there. But the best part of this open space is just the outlook from the back. So it stretches out to the terrace area, the balcony area outside, which is over a thousand square feet. That's crazy, isn't it? And I really love that actually the kitchen and living area on the um, first floor, when you've got views like this, it's actually such a good idea. Yeah. You don't see it that often in properties that the kitchen is on the first floor, but I really like it. Great way to make the most of the views, isn't it? So let's go see the rest of the living area. Yeah. I can really visualize just taking a seat down here, yeah. putting my feet up and looking out <laughs> to the balcony. I think it's such an incredible space to relax. Yeah. You could literally have your living room here, your dining room um, that side, You've got your kitchen, and you can also even have a study, a little study or library area. It's such yeah. a big space in here. This is a boss yeah. seat, for sure. Yeah. Kind of reminds me of like a bachelor pad. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's got that kind of vibe to it, which is so cool. But the terrace is looking very appealing. It does, and we didn't mention earlier, actually outside, and we'll show you more of the garden, there's planning permission to put a swimming pool in there. I think a hot day like today, perfect to run out jump over the balcony into the swimming pool. So let's go have a look. Don't try that at home. <laughs> wow, this is insane. So insane. Like we said, views, panoramic views all the way around. The only neighbour is the neighbouring pump house, which was yeah. sold, I think, around three years ago. A beautiful property in itself. Mm -hmm. um, and when you're looking back here, it kind of gives me that Tony Stark uh, vibe. Yeah. Like, like you say, like a bachelor pad. Full of technology cool. downstairs, really, really nice. You could like have a barbecue party up here, or even just have like a DJ partying in, party in the garden. Oh yeah, so cool. Visualize that for yeah. sure. Well, guys, we forgot to mention there's actually an additional bedroom up here with its very own ensuite, and also like the ground floor bedrooms, it overlooks out the back. And guys, if you enjoyed watching this video, please remember to like and subscribe, and check out our other luxury video tours um, of luxury properties around the UK. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching.